Hi, my name is Enes Yilmazer, and today we're going to check out this house. So today we are touring 1049 Loma Vista. This is an amazing home in Truesdale Estates in Beverly Hills. Five bedrooms, eight baths, 7,600 square feet, listed for $50,625,000. But most importantly, the entire property is filled with Andy Warhol art and his own Rolls Royce that he used to own. So stick around. As we're walking into the space, I want to talk about Truesdale Estates. There are only 535 homes that are built, and pretty much anything in Truesdale Estates is iconic, and this home is one of them. As we walk into the kitchen, I just realized we have another Andy Warhol original piece here. I like my tomato soup. And it's 30% bigger, just like me. So here we are in the kitchen, pog and pole, kitchen cabinetry, that's beautiful. But most importantly, look at this countertop. This is quartzite that has a beautiful island. I love the detail of where countertop and the cabinet doors have a little gap. This is a really modern finish. We have a different countertop here. Honestly, I don't know what this one is. I'm gonna say some sort of a textured quartz. We have a five burner uh, gas. The prophecy is true. Gas stove, melting gas stove, where they built the dials into the cabinetry. It's a very, very nice detail with a little bit of a Biniana touch here. I guess in myself, but look at the sink. Here's the other detail that I really, I really like about the sink. The drain it is not on the center. It's actually sloped that way. So that kind of gives, adds up to that modern touch a little bit more. As we continue, built in oven. We've got the remaining appliances, another oven, your microwave, and most importantly, me and Mikey's favorite, built-in coffee maker. I really like 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 how they kind of put the black with the dark wood with this like super bright countertop, you know? I agree, I agree. It's kind of like an old 80s mid-century with a really modern touch though. Yeah, and not to mention all the light you get from the skylight. Yeah. It's incredible. And that skylight detail is kind of a little iconic for Truesdale Estates. So a lot of modern homes in Truesdale tends to have a sloping roof skyline designs here and there. And the master bedroom. Starting off with a pivot door because in Beverly Hills, you get a luxury modern home, you get a pivot door. People like to pivot. People like to pivot, let's just be honest. But amazing master bedroom, huge scale, built-in speakers throughout. That opens up to, again, backyard with the uh, Fleetwood pocket doors that pockets into the wall so you can get this full indoor outdoor feel. Master bathroom. I mean, there's so many details to talk about here. Freestanding tub with a tub filler from the ceiling. I've never seen that before, have you? I did. Uh, I actually did it in one of my projects, believe it or not. Really? Yep. And then uh, you have two vanity tubs here. I honestly don't know what countertop this is. I'm gonna guess. There's a quartzite again, just like the kitchen. What are you doing? I'm trying to get out of your shop. <laughs> and we have an amazing shower space with a little exit to a patio. You take your shower, you want to rest a little bit? This is exactly what people need after they shower. And you can do that. Yeah, just sit out here naked and dry off. <laughs> I air dry. Air dry. So here we are in the backyard of this amazing property. First thing I see is this beautiful zero edge pool. It is just seamless into the space. But most importantly, city like Beverly Hills and Truesdale, people value their privacy a lot. And this backyard with this lush greenery that truly uh, covers the property where you get perfect privacy and not to mention you kind of have your living room space really open up to the outdoor area which kind of ties the whole space together. So, 
as we walk into the entertainment space again, guess where we're going? Movie theater. Mikey's favorite room. I really like the light fixtures. They're kind of interesting. So here we are in one of the bedrooms, currently staged as an office with a little patio area that is private to this room. But as we walk into the space, we constantly run into any Warhol artwork. In this case, dollar sign underwear. Signed, Andy Warhol. Behind this door is the reason why we came to this house, because we have a one-of-a-kind 1974 Rolls-Royce driven by Andy Warhol. This is actually Andy's car that is also part of this house if you would like to purchase it. Guess the price tag? I'll give you some time to think about it. All right, I will say it. It's actually worth $1.5 million. Wow. One thing that I really like about this property is how it's been marketed. They put a lot of Andy Warhol original artwork in this house and turn it into an art gallery. The entire artwork collection is worth $650,000 and Rolls Royce is $1.5 million. Gonna learn that today. You can purchase this property with or without the art, but I suggest you do with because it really complements the property and who doesn't want to own Andy Warhol's Rolls Royce? Yeah. Let's just be real. And there's like 20, what, a tw at least 20 different original pieces throughout the house. And not just uh, prints, there are sculptures and all the other artwork as well. Yeah, and not only, not all Andy Warhol either. Not all Andy Warhol. Yeah, there are some other artists as well, which will bring up the total to $17,750,000. So we just finished touring this amazing property on Loma Vista. The space is great, art really complements. I love this property. What do you think, Mikey? I really like that they package the art with the house. I don't think we've seen many houses that have done that. I like all the skylights they have on the top floor. Uh, and I love that kitchen, the, the wood and the black finishes. And that really complements. All right, guys, thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. Give us a like because that helps the algorithm. That gets our videos pushed, and we'll see you guys on the next video.